All right, this is the final part. I'll talk for maybe 15 minutes. I'm done here, guys. Oh, I've made longer videos. Sorry, man. I don't feel like talking too long. I want to watch Cobra Kai. I know if I make like a one and a, one and a half hour video, two hour video, by the time I'm done, it's like nine o'clock. And I take my walk, it's like 11 o'clock, and I, I only I have to watch Cobra Kai. And I gotta go to bed because I have work tomorrow at 8, 8 45, I think, tomorrow, Thursday. I have work. Sim Center. Yeah. So I have all the actors are really in my bag. Yeah, man. They're in a bag. I want all the actors who are in my movie, once they, once they experience that worldwide fame in me, they're going to beg Ivan, please, 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 Ivan, please. I be in the next movie, please, man. I don't want to go back to Hollywood, man. Hollywood is nothing like your company. I'm like, no, you're not here for the next movie. Ivan, please, please, man. I don't want to look behind Ivan, please. No, I said, man, look, man, that's not, that, that pity game is not going to work on me, man. You're not good for the next movie. You're going to go back to Hollywood, man. You got to deserve <laughs> I'm not to do with that, man. You're not good for the next movie, guys. I'm not going to have the same actors in my movie. Ugh. You beat Keanu Reeves of an Apple bag, guys. Those guys are big, man. Someone like Will Smith, if he's in the Hidden Vampire movie, or um, Leonardo DiCaprio, Robert Downey Jr., Dwayne Johnson, those bigger actors, even they're going to beg. I even like, can I be next movie, man? Please, man, you're copying so much Brandon Hall. I'm like, no, guys. You're not going to next movies, I'm sorry. You know, there's a movie called The Great Escape that came out in the 60s, I think. So I might call it The Great, the Great Escape of, 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 of Secret Organization or something like that. The Great Escape of the Secret Organization. Call it that. But there's a movie that came out called The Great Escape in the 60s, I think. But there's many movies that came out that had the same names, right? So I don't know. Now, I don't, I don't want to get in trouble with 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 with, 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 with the copyright laws and all that stuff. So you know, I gotta be careful. So yeah. <laughs> what should I do for the cover, Ivan? My dear, for the cover for the Great Escape, did you see me? You you get this you get this uh you get this this image of me and my seven other. We're holding it like we're running, and while I'm running, I'm holding her. I'm holding. She's holding my hand behind me, like this, and I'm running. You know what I'm saying? And you have, and it's a small picture, but we're the main focus of, of of the cover. Obviously, us two in the middle. I have my hand. I'm gonna tell the um. That's why I'm creative. I'm gonna tell the graphic scientist a picture of me and my other. I'm holding her hand like this. We're like running, on on the run. And it's like a, a small zoomed in, a small picture. And you get this big picture of like Keanu Reeves, Ben Affleck, and Scarlett Johansson, and then they have guns like pointing, so you get this, you get this idea that, oh my god, this organization is so big, it's like these guys can't escape, we're all, you see me and my son, we're on the run, we're a lucky couple who escaped, and you see these big, the big picture of Keanu Reeves on them with like guns, like this, something cool like that, yeah, hi, you're creative, yes I am, yeah. The Great Escape will have crazy one of us two men. But not as crazy as Anus. Yeah, because the major thing is most likely not happening, guys. It's most likely the Great Escape with Keanu Reeves. I just pray to God this thing does not get delayed. Because once Keanu Reeves hits his 80s, it'll be done. 70s, he's fine, but 80s, he's done, man. And so I hope this thing does not get delayed. Because Keanu Reeves will be in his 70s when he films The Great Escape. It'll be maybe 75, maybe. 74, 76, 77, maybe. He'll still be fine. He's a little older, but he'll be fine, obviously. He's a badass. Uh, he's badass in the movie, obviously. I 
How much you made Great Escape for Ivan? Six eighty seven hundred million. I'll make it for seven hundred million. Um, I'll make it Great Escape for. If you want to make an amazing movie, you got to put a lot of money towards it. I also have to create room to pay, like Ben Affleck, Scott Johansson, and Keanu Reeves are costing me a lot of money, man, for their base alone. And you also have to pay Brie Larson. You have to pay Paul Bettany. You have to pay Javier Bardem. You have to pay John Krasinski. You know what I'm saying? They're not, they're not cheap, those guys. Well, Brie Larson and Paul Bettany, all of them are cheaper because they're small aces. But John Krasinski and all of them are not cheap. They're going to they're gonna want a lot of money because they're greedy animals. John Krasinski, I'll pay him like $60.5 million, $60 million for his base. And he gets like a $7 million bonus, $7.5 million bonus. That's good enough for him. And I'll give him 20, the low end, 26, 27 million of the royalties. That's a good deal for him. He's worth like 80 million. Give him like 27, 28 million. If he's worth 100 million, I can give him 30 million of the royalties. 31, 32. Depends how much he's worth. Then Keanu Reeves gets the high end. He gets the 125 million for his royalties for the Great Escape. Then I'll pay him like 70 maybe. If he's worth more, if he's worth two hundred, but I can pay him seventy-five. Scarlett so Johansson, if she's worth two hundred more, I can give her sixty-six, sixty-seven. I'll give her sixty-one million of the royalties. That's good enough for her. But after he gets seven million of the royalties, and Keanu Reeves gets one twenty-five million of the royalties. This is excluding their bonuses and rich salary. So I'm saying, and their merch money, their game money too. They won't make much off the game for that because they, for. For the greatest sake, we play as me, my as an, uh, my sister, and other. We don't play as them. They're, they're CPU characters. But they're in the cutscenes, or they're going to be doing voice work, all that stuff. Some zero. Now, the Great Escape game will have crazy buzz, man. Like, you're looking at something crazy like that. You're looking at an amazing game. It starts off with me and my sister, and other. We're in New York, we're looking for jobs. We actually have that in the game. And we join this company, we train, and we're on the run. Something fucking cool, yeah. It's gonna be better than Zane's game. The greatest hit game will be better than Zane's game. But Zane's movie will be better than the greatest game movie. So, Zane? Yeah. I'm kind of being that robot story. I'm like, no, guys. <laughs> You're not getting off of the robot story. Oh, my God. I want to be in that robot story, I I'm like, no, guys. You're not getting off the robot story. Okay? Yeah. Oh, I mean, seriously, man, like, Hollywood's not your company. I'm like, I know, but look, man, you guys are very successful. I didn't launch your careers. You guys can get roles on problem. You, 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 you're, 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 you're still going to have a, a successful career in Hollywood. Yeah, but I have my career feels meaningless without you, man. If, if, if I'm not in your movie, my, my career feels worthless. Yeah, you feel like shit. You're a side tension. Whereas me and my son are the main show, we're the main events. Yeah, man. With the main events. So I'm going to do the five movies. Yeah, I'm going to do Zayas first. The last one was Zayas first. Three volumes. Then The Great Escape. Then There You Need, The Romance Story. Then The Hidden Vampire Movie. Then The Western Gangster Movie. And that ends phase one. So you're looking at a 20 year... A 20, 22 year term for phase one. Then phase two, I'm thinking Spider-Man Miles Morales. I play an older version of Miles Morales. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Or I can do a comedy series. Um, or I can do that hockey series. I don't know, man. I'm thinking Spider-Man Miles Morales. I have to purchase the rights off Hollywood, though. Sony. I don't want to own. I, I don't want to own the the, the Sony the, the Miles Morales brand. I want to have the licensing rights to to make a movie. So you guys still maintain the rights. But you license it out to me. I you, I, you charge me. Uh, I have. It's gonna cost me a lot of money. Yeah. If you want to license the rights to make, to make a Miles Morales movie, you have to give us a good maybe three hundred million dollars or something like that. 
for licensing rights. I don't want to own your brand. I just want to license the right to make this trilogy. Obviously. Are we getting a piece of the royalties, Ivan? No. I'm not giving you shit. You're not worth my royalties. I pay a licensing fee for it. I don't mind even paying you a bit more. If you want to be greedy, look, man, I don't mind even paying you $500. I'd rather pay you $500 and have you take a piece of the royalties than you do like that. Whereby you're you're making you you you're benefiting off my 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 success. I'm not going to do with that, man. A one-time licensing fee. I have street street smarts. I'm not fucking stupid, guys. I'm not going to let you do me. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to let you do me. Yeah, man. I'm not going to let you do me. Yeah. But phase two is a long time from now. I don't want to focus on that right now. Right now, my main focus is Lasso for Zanus. That's my main focus right now. The Lasso for Zanus is my main focus. And after that, the Gray Escape. I will make it now so when you sign a deal with Amazon, yes, I will. You know what I'm saying? Uh, um, Sky of Source Entertainment. No. Ivan O'Mara and uh, I say her name. Victoria Justice partnered with Amazon. They sign a, a par partnership agreement. We say how much money we're making. You don't have to do that. No. Just say we sign a partnership agreement with them. Amazon owns the distribution rights. Ivan and Victoria Justice own the uh, the production rights and the brand. And it gets featured on the Sky Switch. It's a whole world's tuning in. They went crazy. Oh my god, it's happening. They signed that deal. The deal got signed. Yeah, the deal got signed, man. Yeah. Now we gotta work. Work on the movie. And we get our 80% for the merch and for the movie box office. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of money, man. Yeah, that's why I don't need other. I don't need other business. This is more than enough money. I don't need any more money, man. It's enough money for me. Yeah. <laughs> I said, I was like, yeah, this is more enough money for us. We don't. We, yeah, we don't need to start any more businesses. Take the stress of us. We do the movie. And we go on a vacation and enjoy Vancouver and the condo. We get ready for the great escape of calories after Rosanus. This is a five-year project. Five fucking years, man. That's crazy. That's why everyone hates me with keys, Ivan. They're not going to be you, Ivan. They're not going to be as successful like you. That's why everyone hates me with the keys. Yeah. That's why everyone in my life will remember me, man. They want to remember me, yeah. Especially the people I was supposed to be friends with. Yeah, I remember Ivan. I went to school with him. We hung out a lot of times. 
he slept over at my house. I smoked with him. I got drunk with him. You know what I'm saying? Was he really poor back then? Yeah, he was, man. He was poor. Like, look at the videos. This is him when he was poor. And yeah, look at the videos. Holy shit. Ivan was poor in these videos? Yeah, yeah. This is when he was poor, man. It's weird. Like, the new, the new, the next generation, right? But, like, it's weird because now he's a famous movie star with his living under. He's fucking rich and he's king now. This man was poor. It's no, it's tough for the next generation to actually believe that I was poor because I'm, I, I can make easy money. I have the keys. They're used to seeing me f famous celebrity as a famous celebrity now. That's why it's hard for them to believe that I was poor. Whereas you guys know what it was like when I was poor, but even you guys will feel like shit too. Yeah, I remember when Ivan pumped up wheels for us when he was poor, and now he's rich with this and another. Yeah, he's a famous movie star. And you do, oh my god, it's so weird seeing Ivan trending now, and now he's featured in the magazines for Sky Source News. You know what I'm saying? And and, 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 and he's, he's filming movies, he's a movie star now. He's signed on with Amazon. And you go back and watch my YouTube video, this is him when he was poor, talking about Sky Source, and now he has his own Sky Source company. It's so weird, and you feel like total shit. And that's why I call it the Miscellaneous Series, because this series will be missed. It's gonna be missed, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. It's crazy, huh? Yeah, man. This series we missed. Yeah, man. Was that? Yeah, we missed. And the people who move in, move into this house are gonna feel it. I even lived here. Yeah, I even lived here for for almost thirty years. I even yeah, I even lived here for almost thirty years. Holy shit. The, the new the new family that moves in here because once I pay the fee and the gates now I now know I now I now know the gates are rich now the gates will are, are, are I know I'm gonna have to hide the wealth and where they're gonna find they're gonna get out of the house they're gonna sell this house and now they're living a the lavish life obviously so sorry because right now they're they hid their wealth from me these are fucking crazy people yeah. And so I'm beating up, I set everything up. Yeah, the only way for the for the gates lock doors and Ivan for Ivan to not know that the that they're rich, I have to hide their wealth. But then once I pay the fee, I, I now find out how rich you are. That means you hid your wealth from me for 40 years. 40 fucking years, guys. They, they I'm gonna be paying the fee when I'm almost 40. I'll be paying when I'm like in like 40, right? That means they hid their wealth from me for 40 years. Four decades, man, they hid their wealth from me, man. You see what I'm saying? How I say everything out whereby I'm piecing out after I find out what you are? Yeah, man. I'm like, what the fuck? So this whole time you were rich and you, you lived in that, you, you moved into that shitty apartment in Montreal for, for poor people. Lived in this shitty apartment in Montreal. Lived in that shitty apartment in the hall. And finally they bought a house in 2001, but this house is shit for someone who's a gatekeeper. It's a nice house for a middle class family. For a gatekeeper, this is shit. You could have bought at least like a $500,000 house with an outdoor pool. You settle for this because they're fucking cheap. They don't like me, man. Yeah, man. 
I just want to give him the keys. I'm not stupid. The gates are so blind that they, they'll never let me touch their money. Uh, they'll never let me be part of the lavish life. Hence why I came with the keys. That way I can live that life too. Because they lock all doors on me. So Sarah. That's why I came with the keys. I'm not stupid. Yeah. You don't want me to be a part of your lavish life. You're also not a part of my lavish life either when I'm king. So that's not a good. But you're going to be living the life though obviously when I'm king. They're rich people. They're multi-trillionaires. But they're, they're left behind. They're not a part of me, my and others, fame and glory. They're left behind. There you go. Some siren. Yo, John, man, congrats, man. I, I read I, I read the news. I, 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 you were casted for the role of Tessitone. I said, thanks, man. Hey, man, can you give a team a good word about me, man? I even answered another good word about you, man. Daisy Ridley, Oscar Isaac, Adam Driver, they're going to beg job out here for word. Yeah, man. Yeah, I will, man. Don't worry about it. I'm saying he doesn't give a word. He's selfish. Yeah. That's actually funny. It doesn't mean crazy for the networking in Hollywood. All the agents are going to tell the even the big guys, never with these A&S stars to strike your chances of being high in next movie. Yeah. And the news will be buzzing. Like, once I have my Sky Source news, everyone will be tuning into that. Everyone in Hollywood will say, oh my god, did you hear the news? John Baiga is casted for Tessitonius. Jima Honsu is, ca is, 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 is Cassius. You know what I'm saying? Andy Circus is Job. Did you hear the news? Yeah, I read the news on, on the site. And that's when you get the, the crazy networking frenzy in Hollywood. When they go to events, all the actors are networking with them. But they're not going to give a word. Because they're selfish. So they're not going to give a word, man. It's actually funny. Because they're selfish. Yeah, there you go. They're selfish people. Guys, even the big, big agencies who represent the big A's actors are going to tell the actors network with these actors. The agents are the, the agents are also going to network with, with the actors' agents too. Hey, Mac, you're going to tell the agent, hey, Mac, can you give the team of Sky Source and him a good word about a uh, good word about my client? And I'm saying, yeah, don't worry about that. But they don't give word. They're all selfish. <coughs> they work really hard to get to where they are, man. <coughs> I'm not giving you word. If you asked me for word, you wouldn't give me word either. And now these actors are in Ivan and and it's in another movie. It's in La Sugar, and you're scared that some of them might be bigger than you. And that's why you're panicking. At the same time, you don't want to be left behind. You want to be seen. You want to be a part of Ivan's amazing Sky Source company. Higher paying work, better perks, everything. Being flown on my private jet. Yeah. The actors get flown on my five, my three hundred million private Incredibles jet. That's a nice perk to have, man. To be flown on a private jet. You don't have to fly commercially. You're flown privately on my private jet. Yeah, to sign your contracts. If I go touring, you fly my private jet. Luxury hotel suites. Limo services, driving services, yeah. Nice perks, man. Part up my yacht. Imagine part up a yacht like that, man. The driver drives in the ocean. And what? Do a party there. It's fucking nice, man. Part up a yacht's a nice perk. The, 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 you know, as in you fill on top of the world. The driver drives in the ocean, and the party starts around seven, six o'clock. And then once it gets dark, that's when it's even more fun. The driver drives in the, in the ocean. I don't drive too far. We drive maybe 30 minutes away, and then you can stop the yacht there. 30, 35 minutes away. Pretty deep into the ocean. 
and you can blast music and everyone's partying up in, in the yard in the middle of the ocean. <laughs> yeah. Those days are going to experience that with me, man. Yeah, man, those yacht parties. Fucking nice. And the condo party, too. I'm going to do a jet party, too. On the way to Switzerland, end of third year, when we, when we fly to Switzerland for production, I'm going to do a party my jet. I made a video about it a couple years ago. Remember that? The jet party? Yeah. What's that? Huh? Yeah, man. Sky is super in Hollywood. Anyways, it was real, guys. It's out of America. I'm signing out. Hope you guys enjoyed this. I don't know, 58 minute, almost one hour video. So I'm signing out. Please hope you guys enjoyed this show. Talk to you soon, guys. Bye. Peace.